Buongiorno a tutti quanti e grazie per aver guardato lezione 4 della mia serie Italian for Beginners. Il tema per oggi è numeri da 1 a 100 che si trova a pagina 13 del vostro libro. This is not a long or difficult topic, so I'm just going to jump into it and I'm going to start pronouncing the numbers. Um, I encourage you to pronounce them after me and then I'll briefly explain a couple of the details after I'm done going through all of them. So without further ado, zero, uno, due, tre, quattro, cinque, sei, sette, otto, nove, Dieci, undici, dodici, tredici, quattordici, quindici, sedici, diciassette, diciotto, diciannove, Venti, ventuno, ventidue, ventitré, ventiquattro, venticinque, ventisei, ventisette, ventotto, ventinove, Trenta, trentuno, trentadue, trentatre. And that kind of is the end of where it goes through every single number. Um, so for now we're just going to do the multiples of ten, um, which are quaranta, cinquanta, sessanta, sette. Ottanta, ottanta, novanta, e cento. So I want to cover briefly the way it works um, when you're adding a ones column to those tens. Um, now if you look at the numbers from venti a trenta, um, you'll see that it's it's pretty simple, it's pretty much like English, that you're just going to put the second number after the first number, so 25 is 25. The only slightly different thing is that if you look at the numbers with uno and otto, those are going to actually drop the final vowel in the tens number. So you can see ventuno, ventotto, and in the same way, if you're going to attach those to, say, novanta, you're going to say novantuno, but still novantanove. So if you have any questions about that, or anything else for that matter, um, stick them in the comments, give me a call, email me, I'm happy to help out. Um, and for homework, uh, I'd like you to do the esercizi, uh, pagine 14 e 15 del vostro libro. Um, so, yes, ask me if you have any questions, subscribe to my channel if you found this video helpful, and until next time, arrivederci!